It is the third year of Halloween Horror Nights here in Singapore, so we actually even knew last year that we wanted to play up the number three. Um, three is the witching number, and our third year, we needed to come up with three icons that represent some of our zones. We're pulling from mythology and folklore from a lot of different cultures. We have a scary Chinese opera. We have a Borneo forest, um, bringing in the Malay culture there. And vampires. Vampires go way back in history, very Western. In the past, we've had male characters, so we wanted to scare this year with the girls. We have three ladies. The youngest is the daughter of the undead. She is a vampire killer. The middle-aged one, she's the maiden of the opera. She is a Chinese opera star who uh, turns into a murderer because she's jealous of the new star in the opera. And then we have the crone of the forest. She is the ancient witch of the woods. It's uh, all about the imagination. Uh, a lot of people throwing ideas on the table, talking about it. We got to take all the creative directors and all the creative designers' ideas and bring them to life. And then, we think about how to interpret that in the clothing. We had to do a lot of research um, to find period accuracy in all the costumes. And we got to play with a lot of beautiful fabrics. One of the things the makeup team loves to do every year is try to motivate themselves to find new ways and new materials to use. But this year was really fun because we got to use um, this thing called watermelon lotion. And that's what we used on the maiden of the opera's face to bring her rage to life. So I think there's a little bit of something for everyone. And I think it's really exciting because if you're not into one element, you'll be into another. We're trying to showcase a whole new level of expertise here at Halloween Horror Nights 3 at Universal Studios. Um, so that's something special that we're trying to deliver this year. Um, it's haunted in a special way. There's some very cool tricks that you will see inside of that. I think no matter who you are stepping through the door at Universal Studios, you are going to be scared and you are going to be excited. And I, for one, cannot wait for it to come to life. So be ready when you come in the door.